I needed to take a second and I wanted to apologize to anybody that I might have let down last night. This is, this is kind of hard to understand, but sometimes you can try so hard at something. Sometimes you can be so, so prepared and still fail. And with every time you fail, it's painful. It causes sadness. And especially as I saw last night, it causes disappointment. I've often said a man's character is not judged after he celebrates a victory, by, but, but by what he does when his back is against the wall. So no matter how great the setback, how severe the failure, you never give up. You never give up. You pick yourself up, you brush yourself off, you push forward, you move on, you adapt, you overcome. That is what I believe. You can write everything down if you want to. Be brave enough to write every one of your goals down. But I'm going to tell you something. Life's going to hit you in your mouth and you got to do me a huge favor. Your why has to be greater than that knockdown. And I love it. Buster Douglas got knocked out. Nobody ever got knocked out by Mike Tyson and ever got back up. It was almost a 10 count. I, he was stumbling. They were four, three, two, he, one. And ding, ding, ding. Saved by the bell. And he goes to his corner, the whole world is like, yep, that's it. Once he comes back out, that's it. Mike's gonna just hammer him. And exactly that, Mike Tyson came out like, I got him. I got this kid up against the rope. Listen to me, many of you right now, life's got you up against the rope. You can't give up, you can't give in. Listen to me, if it was easy, everybody would do it. And if life's got you backed up, I need you to do what Buster Douglas did. Buster Douglas start fighting back. The world was shocked. <gasps> Goliath has been knocked down. What happened? And they went to Buster Douglas and they asked Buster Douglas simply like, what happened? And Buster Douglas said, listen to me, it's real simple. Before my mother died, she told the whole world that I was going to beat Mike Tyson. And two days before the fight, my mother died. Buster Douglas had, he had a decision to make. When his mother died, he could die with his mother or he made a decision, I can wake up and I can live for mom. And he knocked Mike Tyson out simply because his why was greater than that punch. His why was greater than defeat. His why was greater than his trial and his tribulation. And I'm telling you, if you don't know what your why is and your why isn't strong, you're gonna get knocked out every single day.
But I won't go back again 